the three South Korean banks say they won't deal with risky crypto exchanges. This article was written by Team Alper on May 25th, 2021 at cryptonews.com slash news. Three of South Korea's five biggest banks, Wuri, Kukmin, and KEB Hana, have said they don't want to work with crypto exchanges, claiming the sector is too risky, a decision that may well jeopardize the future of even when the country's major exchanges. Cryptonews.com approached a number of South Korean exchanges for comment, but trading platforms in the country appeared reluctant to speak on the matter. However, one exchange official, who asked for their platform not to be named, said, We're still in talks with certain banks. This isn't industry-wide, or at least not yet. As reported last week, banks have been effectively given the role of judge and executioner over the South Korean exchange sector, with the government telling them to conduct their own risk assessment checks on exchanges. This has led banking chiefs to create their own almost 90-item strong checklist. Exchanges without banking contracts will be forced to close or face prosecution under rules that promulgated last month, with the grace period ending on September 24. But as per the news agency Yonhap, Wuri, Hana, and KB, none of which currently work with crypto exchange partners, have decided that working with exchanges will be far more trouble than it is worth, particularly perhaps as a regulatory scene appears so changeable in South Korea. The media outlet quoted a senior KB official as stating, We may choose to work with crypto exchanges someday, but for now, as there is the risk of being involved in crimes such as money laundering, it is becoming more difficult for us to become involved. We are not currently considering working with exchanges. Wuri, meanwhile, told the same news agency that other financial institutions may have similar thoughts and added that the risk of hacking and money laundering outweighed the allure of the profits the bank may stand to make where it is to partner with a crypto trading platform. Rivals Nongyup and Shinhan are yet to make their own stances clear. The former currently works with exchange partners. There was also no word from KBank, a neobank that has partnered with the Upbeat Exchange. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and click the subscribe button as these really help our channel grow. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in our next one.